Hey Gems, how you doing? This is Fee Diamond in the Rough and I have an unbagging for you. I will pop down below, hopefully across the screen, who this diamond painting come from because I am not quite sure. <laughs> I've got an assumption but until I open this up I won't know. Um, but it's not something that I have ordered. Definitely not something I recall ordering at all. Um, yeah. Okay, so I've got no idea. I'm going to have to check out some websites to see if they are in there. But in the meantime, let's have a look at what's in this. There it is. Let's tackle this one that way. Okay. I think this is the another company that contacted me. Okay, so here we go. It's quite interesting. There's no... Yes, it is. Okay. This is a company that contacted me. <laughs> and I'll just pull up their email. Um, all I got from the email, this is Libby from adiamondpainting.com. So I'll put the details to below. The online store specializing in diamond painting products. I contacted you through your YouTube channel. I wrote this email to get in touch because I want to discuss diamond painting a bit more and see if we could collaborate on something similar in the future. And I got back to them and said, yep, love to. And then turned around and said, um, hang on, where are we going? I turned around and said, I said I would and I'd like to choose these images um, and there was something on their diamond painting page in their accessories uh, in their diamond painting tools was a pen and I wanted to show an accessory box I wanted to show a, pe a special pen and she said oh well we'll select the diamond painting for you but we will sh send you the pen um, I will say this much no, I haven't haven't got the pen, so I will send this to Livy, this unboxing to Livy in its raw state, and um, I will let you know what the response is as I go along. But here we go. Uh, I need that to keep that one. So the image is, and it's really funny. This is all I know. It's just saying a diamond painting is the only re reason why I know who it is from. <clears throat> because I didn't get a confirmation. I wasn't told what I was going to get. It was just this is what I will send you. Um, 24 colours. Obviously it is a deer. It's supposed to be a 40 by 50. Square drill it is. So it is 45 by about 34 and a half. So they refer to the canvas size. Um, okay, so this one will, this is not too bad in the way of being bent. I will say that companies have gone more towards the port blue because um, they tend to travel better. Okay, let's just get that on. But that doesn't mean that they can just package it up and roll it tightly and give it bends. So this one will this one will need the hairdryer to straighten it, but it's not too bad. Let's get that better. 
that in itself helps. Okay, so size. Let's check that wax. Other, it is really sticky. Symbols. We have light on dark colours and dark text on light colours. Clarity. Symbol clarity is pretty good. Uh, that's going to be a lot of fun. The hearts and the diamonds for my eyes a little bit difficult, but shouldn't be too bad. My guessing is the hearts is a 310. Yep. <laughs> okay, now these are individual baggies. So this one is one that I won't, probably won't get up in any other way, but by. I might work on this one via the baggies. So I'll pick quickly call these out, but if you can look at the colours, they are the autumn colours. Um, <laughs> in Australia, the only deer we see in most cases is oh there's a smell. Okay. Um most cases we see deer and we look at it and go, oh, venison. <laughs> deer farms that are just for the meat. Okay, 24, 23, 22, 21, 20, 18. Turn those numbers around the right way. 18. Seventeen, sixteen, fifteen, fourteen, thirteen, twelve, eleven, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, three, two, one. There's the four. And there's the 19. So all 24 colours are there. Um, yeah. Just that little smell. Of the, just as a heads up, there is a bit of a smell to it. Let's put these drills in a tray. It is the drills that you can smell. Well, I can smell anyway. But let's just. How about I do a bigger tray? That's better. Now, you, now we can really see them. Okay, close up look to the three tens. Oh, a little bit of trash. Not much that I can see in there. Okay, they don't look too bad. I can't see any knobbly bits, which is a good thing. Okay, so there we go. Um, so I will send this uh, to Viv to check out. Um, any comments I'll get from her, I'll let you know. Um, but basically everything is there in the diamond painting. Drills look okay. <coughs> There's just that little funny smell for some of us. We, you know, you've probably come across that funny smell. Come on, focus. There we go. So they don't look too bad. Got the nice clean backs on them. Okay, so there we go. Pack this one aside. I'll get this one done eventually. Um, but all in all, square diamond painting with squares. It's not a true 40 by 50. 40 by 50 is the wax, uh, is the cover, the canvas. I will get that right. So I will pop a link down below. Check her out. Her, he, you never know nowadays. Um, check out uh, your diamond painting. Um, 
they've got an interesting section there with all these toolkits in there. Um, I've never seen such a large range of diamond painting tools. Comes from, yeah, there's all sorts of stuff. So if there's anything that you want in a diamond painting toolkit, you could probably find a toolkit that has just what you want in it. There's such a different range, different range. Okay. So gems, I'll leave that one there. Comment, subscribe, share, like, all that jazz. And uh, bye for now.